Hello everyone, this is just a brief video to introduce the latest version of my laser harp. It's uh, taken about five months of my spare time. I've been making it for a band called The Lost Rites. Hopefully I can just take you through a brief example of some of its functions. This is what it can do. Um, obviously that's going through a certain kind of synth. It's MIDI controlled, so you can put it through any synth you like, but it's MIDI enabled. So this is our control panel on the laser hub. As you can see, there's a few changes since last time. Last time I had only had six buttons. Now that would have been these six buttons here. Um, and those control a semitone along the top row, uh, octave, and scale. Now there's a few others. <coughs> Obviously you can see I'm changing up through the semitones there. Um, what these other two no, it's up and down here. These other two will control temporary semitone, so they only sharpen or flatten the note while you're holding it down. Uh, same with the octave. I can flick through the octaves there, and also have the temporary control here. <coughs> and then I have the green row, which controls scales. So I'll just give you a brief example of this. Uh, so I'm playing in D major. Um, or I can make that say something a little odd. A D pentatonic. A whole tone scale. It's also quite high pitched, so I'll just. So you get the idea with that. So I also have the temporary scale controls here, although they're actually of limited use. Um, so. The other major change is this blue row, which you know, I've decided to assign to CC controls, so I can use them to control effects in your um, digital audio workstation software. So, let's see. On the first, oh, on the first, I have a a filter effect. On the second, is an octaver. Um, this one is a pitch feedback, so it's a feedback loop with a pitch shifter in it. It's very, very weird one. And a reverb, a very long reverb on this last one. So I can obviously combine those. And get some very weird noises. So this one is also velocity sensitive, as the uh, last one was, so the faster you break a note, the louder it will be, and the softer you do it, the quieter it will be. That's obviously probably the lower limit, but I'm, I'm working on making it a little bit more sensitive to velocity. Okay, well hopefully that covers all the functions. Um, let me know how you like the laser hub. 